We are leaders on climate change. What you guys are particularly doing is way out in front of a lot of people. Dickinson really seems to have sustainability thread throughout the fabric of the institution. Dickinson gave some serious thought to climate change and what we could do about it, what we should do about it, and we came to some decisions. Those decisions included making some commitments, specifically a commitment to make climate change a major focus of our academic curriculum. A second piece of it had to do with reducing our greenhouse gas emissions. And then a third piece is about helping others reduce their emissions. I am so proud to announce that Dickinson has reached its goal of carbon neutrality in 2020. In reaching our goal this year, we are one of only 10 institutions that met the goal by 2020. And that comes right on the heels of receiving our LEED Platinum certification for our High Street Res Hall, which again puts us in a very elite group. I think it's a really important issue for students. We feel like the stakes are so high for us as we grow up. Carbon emissions are just going to keep increasing and the impacts of climate change will continue to affect our generation most. The single biggest project we've done to reduce our carbon emissions is our three megawatt solar field, which has reduced almost 10% of our total carbon emissions. We also have recently entered into this off-site uh, virtual power purchasing agreement with three other colleges. Over 95% of our lights on campus are LED right now. My impressions of Dickinson's sustainability is so impressive, so heartfelt, so encouraging. I'm absolutely blown away by the, the commitment of the students, the faculty, to educate, to enlighten, to enhance a better world for us all. I'm really proud to be at an institution like Dickinson College, which very thoughtfully set a goal, set a target 12 years ago, and has been working towards that target ever since then. We're not stopping there. We can't stop there. That's not enough. But this is an important milestone, it's a meaningful milestone, and we're already talking about what comes next. What are we going to do to cut our emissions further? What more can we do, and how can we help others?